Good morning, nation. It's gonna help me out of being. having a good morning. Good morning, dark cat. Megan's on her way up. We're going to do a question and answer time. Did. Let me go get my. Hi, guys. I'll be right back. While we're waiting on Megan, does anyone have any questions for me? Debbie. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Hi, guys. I'm wearing green. Happy St. Pat Patrick's Day. Oh, I'm going to have to. Let me see if I can get in. Oh. Do you want me to move? No. Oh. I just got to stretch and. There. Ooh, hi. And we have light. Um, how far ahead are y'all booked for visits? Um, we are. We have bookings. I think up until September. Yeah. But um, there's patches in between there, so always feel free to reach out, and Lynette can work on it for you. I'm wearing green. Doesn't look like it. My wedding ring. This is my original ring. So. Um, I threw that on today for the green. Yeah, it's, it's very pretty. Thank you. Aquamarine. Hi guys. How are you guys doing today? No, but if you want to send me an email, um, and let me know which date you're looking at, I can definitely check to see if they're available. Hi Yvonne. Hi Yvonne. So... Um, we're going to actually start out the Q&A with some information first. I'm going to start there and then we'll, you can ask questions first or after. So to start out the Q&A, our first thing is, is we did take in a new cat. Actually, two new cats because she can't control herself. I'm sorry, guys. I'm trying. I'm like, no, Lynette, we're full. And she's like, no, we're not. Um... So we took in two new cats. Yay! 
So the first one is Wheeler, and I will spell that for you. It's W-H-E-E-L-E-R. Wheeler is our first one. He actually came from our volunteer, Kim. Um, Kim has never brought in a cat yet to us, which I'm surprised, but she has not brought one in. I feel like we've all brought in a cat at some point. Wheeler is four months old. Let me get you his date of birth. Um, yes, morning Kim. Yes, early morning Kim. Let me see here. Two, two, two. Now we have a for sure reason to fire her. <laughs> no, we can't get rid of our Kim. He is only four months old. He is so cute. His uh, date of birth is uh, November 30th, 2022. So that puts him at uh, three months and seven, 17 days. He is the sweet. Do you want to go get him? Sure. A gay. He's um he's solid gray with like a little white boop right here. He is about the. She found him at the um. She found him outside her house, and she had asked me about it a couple days ago and said, you know, I found this cat. He seems to be really sweet. Can I bring him in? Um, and uh, I said, of course, you know. So she brought him in overall he seems like he might have just a little tiny bit of a um just a maybe a gunky eyes stuffy nose but overall his health is really really great so i'm going to be treating that and then we'll put him in uh patty's place today it's actually sealed up and ready for him so we're going to put him in there and just kind of let him see the main room and all that stuff so he's actually he is a sweet boy he is cute hi wheeler of course, he's not neutered. You can see tick attacks there. Hi, Wheeler. He's very thin. Hi, we. Oh, he's like, oh, there's. Can you look over here? Hello. Hello, there's the Wheeler. Um, oh, show him. He's like, I got very handsome green eyes. He's so cute. Hi, buddy. Isn't he? He does actually look like a little Steven. His hair is a little bit rough, I think, just from general being outside and malnutrition. His see, his eyes are a little. You can see that third eyelid a little bit, but overall, health-wise, he's fantastic. Um, obviously, we, we've done his his uh, blood blood tests, and that was negative, so he's good to go. Um, hi, you're just the cutest. So look, you can't see his little tail, but his tail's just doing a little, a little flick, a little flick. Um, he is, isn't he handsome? Hi. There. Oh, we should have named him a Saint, like Saint Patty's Day name. Oh, look at him. He's Saint like, Wheeler. <laughs> Saint Wheeler. <laughs> look at him. He's like, what is this? What in all this? Do you want to see what it's about out here? Yeah, the boop is very kind of him to have. This little, can you see it? <laughs> He's like not, I'm trying to lift his head. There it is. It's got a little boop of gray to him. He is so handsome. Hi. He's just really calm. He's just like, okay. He, um, oh gosh, can you, can you step back for two seconds? Like, look at this. Okay, there you go. Look at his little tail. His tail's just like boop. It's a long tail. Boop. 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 He's like, oh, oh, look, he's got a little boop of, I didn't see that. He's got a little boop of white in there, too. Just a little boop of white. So we're going to put him in Patty's place for a little bit just to get him used to things, seeing some toys. Um, he's just the happiest little guy. So I was like, man, Kim, you really, when you, when you have him in there, he just, um, do you want to go ahead and put him in Patty's? Mm-hmm. I think. Do you want to call Patty? Hi, Wheeler. Hi, Wheeler. Oh, God, you're so cute. He just, um, when you're loving on him, he just is about rolling over, like, he just, he falls over everything. So he is an absolute, absolute sweet boy. Um, so my next one 
I might need to, uh, hold on, I've got to do some math here. Um, okay. <laughs> Isn't he so cute? He's such a happy boy. Did you put him in already? Yeah, I'm going to grab him. Oh, okay, thanks. So, um, there's some movement in a blanket, and I think it's either Lucy or Spiker in a blanket down here. Who is that? Who's down there? So, the next one, I'll go over with you. The next one is a little bit sad um, to me. It's a little bit of a sad story, but we're happy now, so all is well. The next one, um, his name is Mr. Darcy. He is a little old man. Um, we've actually been jokingly calling him Grandpa um, until we have had his name, which was today we noticed, or, or today we decided to call him Mr. Darcy. Um, he is the sweetest thing. So his background, he had lived with his family um, since he was a kitten. Um, up until a year ago, he's 14 now, up until a year ago when he was 13, they decided that um, it was too much to take care of him um, with, with their home life and their, their small children. So they gave him to a friend of theirs. He was a strictly an inside cat. Um, they gave him to friends of theirs um, to keep outside. The friends had him outside, Mr. Darcy outside for a year. And then after that, they decided that they no longer cared to have him and um, took him back to the original family. The original family kept him outside as well and um, have been trying to find him a home since. So he's, sure, he's 14 now. Um, he is declawed in front, so he's very thin. Last night when we were, um, when I was doing my, my lookovers and checks on him, it did come out that he, uh, uh, he doesn't have any teeth. So he is a toothless little old man. Um, and he looks like a toothless little old man. He is about the sweetest thing. So... I feel very sad for him um, and you know we never know what someone's home life is so I'm trying to keep a positive attitude and I just pray that no one ever gets themselves in that situation where um, they have to do that to one of their family members you know their furry family members so um, wait till you see him he is a he's a ginormous boy. Jem, big thank you to Jem who came up last night to help me do the intake on him. I'm gonna boop this up a little bit. Yeah, that's okay. Hi, Mr. Darcy. Look at that face. Here, Jimmy, can you come closer so they can see how cute he is? He's got I Mr. I know he just he really wants loves. Um gorgeous his face is he's like hi <laughs> and i don't know what happened but his nose is completely like flat <laughs> he his nose is smashed hmm. you've got a small nose it's completely flat with his face uh he is such an old man he definitely needs some good brushing so we're gonna let lanetti um get to him his paws are interesting and you haven't had a chance to see him walk, but he walks um, paws out like this. <laughs> and you can almost see it right here. Um, he only, he's very thin. God, look at, he, I think he's going to be, I did, I do need to cl clip those, Lenny. <laughs> yes. Yeah. It's a good thing um, we took Cosmo home already. That's all I can say. I know, that's, <laughs> yeah, she's like, oh, I don't want Jimmy to see. But look at how cute he is. His face is the most unusual face. Um, but he's only distinguished. It is. He's only um, like a, he's a hair under eight pounds. He's like seven fifteen. No, he's not purring, Nance. But he's calm. He's light. Yeah, he's really light. He's very light. Yes. What's up, buddy? Um, doesn't he have a gorgeous face? He is already neutered. Um, they took him to get uh, vet care. 
He likes it. Um, yeah, he does almost have a Maine Coon face. It's very unusual. Mind if I hold him for a second, yep. Denise? Do you mind? Hi, Grandpa. I took him from the nap. Hi, Hi Grandpa. Hi, Grandpa. Oh, there's a good shot of him. Man. Mm -hmm. you, if you look at his eyes, um, he has no teeth. I think I mentioned that. I can't remember if I did. It says, I, I opened his mouth um, and looked in there, and I think I saw, like, one little dangle in something. <laughs> but uh, look, you can see his eyes are very, very foggy, very old man. So he decided very quick that he loves the food. He likes the food, huh? Yes. The food is very good. So, oh, look at his, look at his little foggy eyes. Oh. Isn't he cute? Health-wise, he's very good. Um, with again, with Jem's help yesterday, um, I was able to do the blood draw on him, which I was a little concerned about. Without having teeth and without having front claws, you know, that makes him more susceptible to getting attacked and, um, you know, not fighting it off. But his blood, his blood draw yesterday was okay. His health overall seems very good. I, I can't attest to his kidney function as I'm not a, a vet, but um, you know, I'm sure we'll be working on you know, getting just an overall general health check for him soon. Um, overall though, he seems very healthy, very furry. But look at his, um, I don't, what do you call that, Lynette? His, this right here, like the front. His snout? <laughs> yeah, his snout, his muzzle. Um, He's like, I, oh, hi. It's very he, flat. It, yes, I wish I could see him. Let's see if I could see a, a profile. Look at yeah. that there. <laughs> see the profile? It's very flat. Jowl. He's like yes. uh, a TV show in the 80s where the guy was a cat. <laughs> Ron Perlman. His ears are good. He had, did you look in his ears? No, I, I didn't haven't. see a lick of ear mites or Aww. nothing. So... He, I asked the family if um, yeah, he was so good with, with kids. They said he was fine with the kids. Um, I asked if he had any um, accidents in the house, and they said, you know, over the, the 13 years, he had had a couple accidents, you know, a new duffel bag brought in the house, you know, and so he would tinkle or something like that. But he, he was a very, very good boy, which, you know, makes me sad thinking of him being inside for like 13 years and then outside he's like what did I do wrong I don't know but um, he will never have that again ever 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 I promise promise and is it yeah see that's what I think of the yeah I wonder if some of it because his weight when he fills back out of the face will fill out maybe yeah yeah so he is as you can see he's just a he just wants someone to just love on him. Just love on him. That's all he wants. He is huge. Um, we have a, him in just a, a temporary container or a pen to to have him in there. And we have a little bed in there, and he just spills out of it. He's he's actually going to be a very large cat if you can tell by his little his little paw mitts. Oh, his paws. Big feet. Big big feet. I think when you get healthy, you're going to be a very big man. He decided very much last night, but um, that he likes the he likes the heat pad. I put a heat pad mm -hmm. under him, and he's like, "This is delightful." So we gave him some very delicious mama and baby cat food last night, and some canned food. There you go. So there's Mr. Darcy. He's been sleeping a lot. He's like, "Of course I am. I'm a little man." And I have no teeth. It was almost it was almost comical when I looked in his mouth. I'm like, I don't I don't know that I've ever inspected a mouth mouth where there was like nothing in it. <laughs> like it was just like there was just gum. I was like, I saw like one little broken jagged hanging on, and I know if I could just grab it, it would just like pop out. But uh, that's okay. We'll make sure you get. Oh. 
Yes, Joe, I think he will be a keeper. <laughs> a keeper? A keeper. A keeper. You Mr. A keeper? Darcy. Yes, Mr. Darcy. Yeah, like Susan spelled it there. <clears throat> so... <coughs> You're never going to have a cold time ever again. So, isn't he sweet? So. What you looking at? Mm-hmm. He's like pressing his fat, flat face against me. Okay, mm -hmm. do you want to go see Uncle Jimmy? <laughs> Maybe Jimmy would like him. Oh. Got our hands full of cows, though. Uh, poor buddy. Oh, look at his little... Oh, you got litter foot. That's what it is. Oh! Where are you going? He's like, coffee. you're warm. Bottom to me. Yes. Thank you, Jimmy. You're welcome. I know. He, uh, he, 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 he pulled all of our heartstrings right away. She saw him and she's like, oh, sweet heaven, I don't want Jimmy to see him anymore. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, yes. So, Anyways, so now we have Mr. Darcy, and we've got Wheeler, so we're going to do everything we can to make sure that he's just snug as a bug and a rug and, and happy and all that good stuff. So, there we go. Okay. So, anyways, um, yeah. So, I think he's going to be doing just fine. Uh, overall, his health seems very, very good. So, yep. We're gonna we're gonna spoil him. So we we if, if we keep this business up, we're gonna have to have like just a senior citizen Gen award. Gen Gen uh, yeah, what's that? Geriatric geriatric <laughs> ward. I think that's what we're gonna need. We're gonna need just a geriatric ward. But don't put me and Jimmy in charge because they'll be our house. <laughs> <laughs> Cecilia's doing very good. She's still um, as a vocal and uh, talkative as ever. She's gained weight. So I'm very glad to hear that. She's doing very well. Um, she's about a pound and a half, I think it is, heavier than what she was when she mm -hmm. came. So that's super, super good. Oh, Valerie, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, she's she's just a, a, a grumpy old lady, but we love her. Um, she is still doing a little bit of tinkles outside the box. I think she's just confused on her placement. I did see her yesterday go in, last night actually, she went all the way in and peed. So, um, so he, you know, he's actually, or she's actually doing very, very well. So, um, at value, that's the hardest part. Oh, thank you guys. So yeah, so, um, we're sorry, Valerie. I don't know, Selena. <laughs> so Darcy and Jimmy are gonna go. Oh, oh! I don't think I don't think Cosmo would allow anybody to look at Jimmy. No, it's that's his dad, and and everybody is aware of it. So, mm. so there's that. So the next and any questions that you guys might have, I think other than that, everybody's doing very good. Um, mommy and babies are doing very good. Uh, Camby's doing very good. All the health issues, actually, I think, seem to be, that kind of would, seem to be okay. So, if that's all you guys have for us, we'll actually wrap it up here shortly, and unless you can think of anything else. But, anything else you can think of, Lynette? Uh, Reginald, none that has been diagnosed by our vet. You, you know, Napa, I, she's she's had a little limp. I have I'm not seen anything. Um, yeah, major. I, I think she must have just jumped down and, and jimmied it or something. She has no problems putting any weight on it. She doesn't uh, wince if I squeeze it. So I think she just might have 
zigged when she should have zagged. Milady is adorable. She's doing very well. How are the twins, October and Wix? They're actually doing amazing. I, I'm surprised that no one snapped them up. Um, <laughs> where's Cauliflower? Cauli is, she's kind of all over. I would, I would have a very hard time telling you where she specifically goes. She's everywhere. She really <laughs> is everywhere. I've seen her just kind of be bopping all around. Um, is there anyone on hold? So far, only Cavendish. Um, there's not really, I have, I've got a few applications um, that I'm still working through, but nothing that I have anything concrete to tell you guys yet. Thank you, Mata. Um, are there any immediate needs? Oh, golly. Um, I think on our, the only thing I can think of is, I mean, if we're still going by our list, uh, the last things that we were out of was toilet paper, paper towels, um, and low on baby food. I know we have, we have had some come in, so I think we're doing pretty good, so. She's kind of, she's, I think a lot, Nance, is she's, she is more out than you think she is. She's just, um, blends in with the other cats. You know, we have a lot of gray tigers that look like her. So I know sometimes I don't see her. Susie, you know, she, I agree. I see her more at nights too when I come in for night meds. Thank you, Susan. Um, how are Kim and Billie Jean? They're actually doing really good. Yeah. Out of your bed. Mm -hmm. How's Caden doing? He's doing okay. I would really, really love to see him in a home. Um, they are. He's he's doing really good. I, I have not gotten an application on him yet. I wish. Um, I think he would do. Oh, there's Lucy Pie. <laughs> Hi. Hi, Lucy. Oh, do you have breakfast over here? <laughs> Was you saving that? You got like breakfast on your chin. There. There. Hi. Um, uh, let's see here. She does look like Shakespeare, yeah. Um, I think I had missed one other question. I apologize. Where's the chatters page where you post the pictures? Arlene, if you're not on the chatters page, send me an email at ffrcmegan at gmail.com with your Facebook link and I can see about getting you added to the chatters page. Egypt does love to play with the kittens and the kitties. Yeah, he's such a sweetheart. Um, is Pania doing better with her URI? Um, URI is upper respiratory infection. Mm. She, she's, um, tough case. She, yes, she is a tough case. She is chronic. Um, she's just one of those where I feel like she has times where she's okay and times where she's bad, but never times that she's great. That's probably a, not the best explanation for her. Can I ask, is there a special way you hold the CH cats? Um, Sam, we just try to be as gentle as possible and hold them securely. A lot of them like Lucy right here, um, likes having that stable feeling of being held up to their body like that, so it helps them not wobble so much. Mm. Go ahead. <laughs> Magic is not, he does not like to be picked up real well. Uh -uh. Um, you'll see me pick him up, but not for very long because he just doesn't like He doesn't to be care helped. for it, no. He loves to love on you and you love on him. But he's not one that you can just pick up and hold. Yeah. You can he doesn't, he doesn't want to be tied down that long. Yeah. <laughs> he's a bachelor. Nothing yeah, can hold him down. Exactly. Um, yeah, I was just going to say that. He's. You can generally get him for like a few seconds. You know, like I'll, I might show him at the cam for just a few moments. 
And then he's like, okay, I, please put me down, thank you. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's such a sweetheart though. We, we love him very much. He just kind of got, he's been liking going in the welcome room lately. I don't know why, but some, I'm like, he hasn't done that for quite some, um, he hasn't done that for quite some time. So <laughs> all of a sudden he's enjoying the welcome room. Other than that, guys, anything else? We'll get heading out. <laughs> Lucy's like, I'm enjoying this hold sesh. She's like, you can just put me on your desk. <laughs> he, yeah. He does zip, zip, zip. It, Dagged is also another one that's not a huge fan to be picked up. N nope. You have to come to him on his level. He's not a big fan. And he was always kind of like that as a kitten, too. He never cared to be picked up and held. And if you did, you, he wanted down pretty soon. So, yeah, he's not a big fan of it. Uh, Egypt's doing wonderful. I'm actually very impressed with him. He stayed out last night. He was just sleeping in bed so good, I didn't even want to bother to wake him up to bring him to a pin. But... Oh, thank you. Thank you, Kaysen. He was a, that, man, that Mr. Darcy's really pulling at my heartstrings. He's so cute. And old Manny. I wish I could, you should look in his mouth. I, I just don't, you know, like, I don't, I don't look in Egypt's mouth because, or not Egypt's, uh, Spiker's mouth, because there's really no need to. Mm -hmm. He doesn't have teeth, so we don't need to check him. Right. Um, so I guess I was surprised opening his mouth and not seeing anything. <laughs> Egypt does seem happier. Yeah, I think he's doing really good. Um, I imagine it's going to be, um, a bit before he gets that, that full strength on the, his back leg. So I hope that he will just continue to improve, improve, improve. And if he stays this way, at least he's not in pain and he does get some movement out of that back leg. So uh, I'm happy with him. He, he's my little munchkin. Which I don't know where he's at. He's probably sleeping somewhere. Munchkin. Oh, Rambo Dean looks so cute. So, yeah, he, everybody seems to be doing good health wise. So I'm very happy. Oh, look at Lucy. She's like. I just sit right here. I think she. Oh, so then who's, who's there? Oh, that's. I thought that was Lucy in there. Magic zooming up and down the room. Oh, he does. He does. You might just be missing it, Sam. I see him generally zoom. I would say mm, every couple days, I guess. I haven't, I, I don't log it or anything, but he does zoom up and down. He's such a silly boy. Okay. Well, we will wrap it up and get going, and Lynette and I will do some stuff. We've got... <laughs> We've got a lot of stuff, things to do today, so <coughs> we've got, sorry, <coughs> we've got a few nail trims and things we've got to get done too, and we'll have Becky in here, um, what, in an hour for noon? Mm -hmm. All right, well, you guys are wonderful. Thank you so, so, so much. Yeah, sometimes, Kitty's Mom, that's one thing that you don't, um, you know, like, I, I will think that if I haven't seen... Alma go to the bathroom for a long time I'll start to get panicked that she's not going to the bathroom well you're just not watching 100% of the time so I, I've missed a lot you know so yeah all right well you guys are absolutely wonderful thank you so much uh we will see you uh you'll see us around and have a great day and happy St. Patrick's Day we will get to <laughs> well it looks like you're staying oh Lynette just go stay here forever? Yep. I'll get you that little papoose <laughs> where you can put her in. <laughs> Let me get those pregnancy things. Those, what are those things that are like, it's just like a big strip of cloth and you just like wrap it around oh, your waist yeah. and do, yeah. you know, that thing. You could do that for Lucy. 
Lucy's like, that sounds really nice and fun. Uh, <laughs> She's. Uh oh, Star Trek Ooh. trivia new. <laughs> All right, you guys are wonderful. Have a great day. I'll put everything back. <laughs>